Hi, this is Keith and you're watching Stimson's Digital Workshop Series. Today we'll discuss changing tools on the 405 bench press. This machine is a workhorse and a must-have for any shop. It can be used to set grommets, eyelets, snaps, clamps, and more, and all you need to do is put the correct tool in the press. This 405 is set up for number two self-piercing grommets and washers, which are the most commonly used items on the 405. I'm going to start by removing these tools, the top tool here and the bottom tool here. The first step, and this is very important, before you remove the tools, push the handle down. Self-piercing tools have a spring behind them that will push the top tool out with force. Even if you're not using tools with a spring, it's better not to let the top tool fall out. Once the handle is down, Use an 8 inch hex or allen wrench to loosen this set screw at the front of the machine until the top set comes out. You will need to raise the handle a bit to remove the tool and spring completely. Self-piercing tools are the only ones that use a spring, so if you're not using self-piercing tools, you will not find a spring here. Next, use a 3 16 hex wrench to loosen this set screw on the side of the machine and take out the bottom tool. That's all it takes to remove the setting tools. Now you basically reverse the process to put the new tools back in. First, I'll put the bottom set in. The tools will always have a flat side or a groove. If there is a flat side, like this one, that needs to face the set screw so the screw tightens against it. The groove is easier, you just drop it in and tighten the set screw. Now you can put in the top tools. In this case, I'm putting in tools for a number zero self-piercing grommet. Self-piercing tools require a spring to help the grommet stay on the top tool. If you're setting something other than self-piercing grommets, you will not need a spring, but in this case I need it. So I'll insert the spring here, then place the top set onto the bottom tool. If there's a flat side, face that forward so the set screw will tighten against it. Then push the handle down slowly like this. Make sure the tool is all the way in, then tighten the set screw. Now you're ready to go. If you have any issues, just use the information on your screen to contact us for help. And subscribe to the Stimson YouTube channel and check out the other videos in our digital workshop series.